Hello and welcome all as we wait for the start of a match amongst the most anticipated fixtures over the course of the entire season. A day certainly not for the faint-hearted. It is yet another edition of this long-standing conflict between two sides engaged in a never-ending rivalry. One that never has and never will lose its intensity no matter what the context, no matter how many times these two clubs meet. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. And it's as friendly as it can be in the circumstances that we feel the rivalry. Well, in games of this nature, as a player, Peter, you only want to work as hard as demanded. You don't want to have to go at it full pelt. But when the opposition is what it is, all of that kind of goes out the window. The challenge here will ask more of you, and so both teams will, will wish to, to give more than they take. It's one of those games, Peter, where if the opposition increase their effort, you have to follow it. So it's away we go then. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Well, a man who splits opinion, David Luiz. Is he a midfielder or a defender? I would say the former, because he has an impetuous streak that can't be trusted at the back, but full of Brazilian flair, and, and what a shot. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. Maitland Niles. Torreira. Obama Yang. Played back in. And he's there to shoot a goal! Can take battles to win it back. Aubameyang. Kolasinac is charging up on the overlap. Time to deliver. Aubameyang! They've scored! What a clean hit. No one gets in the way of that. Oh, the contact was fantastic, right on the bootlaces, and it packed a lot of venom for what was a really potent strike. Chelsea didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Abraham. For Pastathopoulos. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. And it's been taken straight back. And it's Maitland Niles. Kepa deals with it effortlessly. He's through. Abraham. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. William taking charge of the dead ball. Oh, what a safe and oh! Lacazette gets it away. That's Piliqueta. Lovely bit of skill. Cleared without complication. Tries to get it forward quickly. Defending of the desperate variety. Deflected behind for a corner kick. 
up to meet it. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. A really good feat. William plays it backwards. Has a goal! A real chance and a real let off. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Torreira. And here's Lacazette. Plays it out to the flank. Chance! Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Great run on the overlap here. Great run, this. He's covered quite a distance. The referee's awarded a free kick. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. Perhaps the final meaningful act of the first half. Maitland Niles can hoist it clear. William. Timely intervention. Mesut Ozil. Ozil goes looking. And that'll be the final action of the first half. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. More than a decent game up to now. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. And if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Chelsea didn't have a great first half. They need a change of fortune. Lacassette. Pulisic. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Maitland Niles, who does have an assist to his name. David Luiz. Torreira. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. And it's Lacazette. Torreira. It's come loose. That's some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. Ball through needs to be good here. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Granit Xhaka. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, they may be down, but they're far from out. In terms of chances, they're right up there with these opponents. Done very well to intervene. Now a chance to break. Deftly done. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. And Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. Good challenge, he just stood firm. This has gone, that's a foul. Aubameyang hits one! Well, he so here comes a substitution. <laughs> Emerson. Pulisic. Pedro. Has a pass! 
Mesut Ozil. Torreira. Granit Xhaka. Socrates switches it towards the other side. In the end, it was possession without penetration, the kind that only frustrates managers and fans. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Plays it through. Maitland-Niles has come steaming up from the back for this. Oh, real danger here! He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. He could be... Goes for goal! Oh, and that should have been two. He got too ahead of himself there, thinking how he could have made things safe. It's Ozil! And that would have been game set and match. As it is, it really thought he'd scored to settle this contest, and he's struggling to believe being denied. Now it's William. That's gone a long way up and away. Chelsea have it back and they can go again. And here's William, and here's Pachuayi. Good challenge, excellent challenge. Aubameyang. And time is up. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. Thoughts on what we've just seen? Yeah, and we know that derbies can often make predictions look personality of their own, and. This one didn't really deserve to.